Are you ready? Uh, I am. Put it five on my timer, just so I get perfect distance. All right, whenever you want to go. Let's. So uh, three, two, one, Smurf. Smurf. <laughs> Good luck, dude. Thank you, thank you. One, two, three, four, three. Bam! Good luck. Thank you. So uh, this time there's a tutorial level, but you can just start select out of it because I already know how to play this game. At least I hope I do. Alright, we can start. Bouncing on that shy was a struggle. <laughs> the idea behind that sh bouncing on that shy guy is to skip skip a beanstalk that you're supposed to grow otherwise. But right off the bat in one two, there's a frame perfect trick. You guys like frame perfect tricks? Sure do. I'm gonna spit this flower against the wall, and if I do it correctly, I'm gonna bounce on it. Right, third try is not too bad. Ooh, I got the pipe glitched here. It saves minimal time, but you can do it on like every single pipe in the game. And it adds up. It saves like close to a second. Every time. Sort of jump and press down at the same time? Yep. Worst case scenario is like you ground pound the pipe and you look like a fucking idiot, but it's all good. Nice. 
I didn't expect to get that. If you break that pot off screen, um, it just breaks instantly. No, it's pretty precise. Yeah. And if you face the other way, then the key will uh, bounce out of the pot towards you. So that's, that's a pretty nice time save. Now I have to uh, knock this dude's pants off. <laughs> Good boss. This game has some very strange bosses. <laughs> yeah, to say the least. Oh, bosses. Cool idea, though. Yeah. And the music is uh, on point. Unfortunately, this game has all scrollers, so time to read donations, Captain. Five dollar donation. I hate your buying. <laughs> Certainly pronounced buying. Yeah, I would agree with that, like, bosses in this game are weird, but they all have a uh, different way of, like, different way to fight them, if I can say it this way. Fortunately, this is like the only auto scroller in the early game. The next one's gonna be in Wall 5, so. Yeah. 
Yo. Yo. What's up, dude? No watch. What's going on? Playing a uh, dinosaur game. Hmm. So you're in just in time to give some roll and deep commentary. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. <laughs> Show the Melios Twitch account. Uh, Super Mario World to Yoshi's Island. Oh, my boy. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, boy. The stream is like a minute behind. Huh. Drug free through wall seven. One seven, sorry. Not roll very deep. Not roll and deep, but at least I'm going fast. True. So that room is really fucking annoying. Hopefully, I don't mess it up too bad. I thought I was gonna mess up this fight. You have to have really good uh, reaction skills to that fight. It's never gonna be the same every time. Yes. Salvo likes to uh, behave however the fuck he wants. So, I did this glitched pipe correctly. Alright, I did. So it sends me to uh, this exit for some reason. Saves a few uh, additional seconds. If you go down the pipe again, then it's a... Uh, it's a one-way trip to uh, Tilt City, basically. 
and it snowballs from there. I guess Zelda didn't want to do commentary. <laughs> you need the guy's name written down. <laughs> we'll be back, man. He's just making. He's making a milkshake. Yeah. Okay, so that's probably uh, one of the hardest levels in the early game. Two two. Yeah. Yeah. Even casually, that one always seemed like. It took a really long time. Alright. So with that extended flutter right there, I just skipped, um... I don't even know what I skipped, actually. Bouncing on that toady, though, it allows me to skip having to uh, grab the baby Mario star. That saves a really good amount of time in this level. The rest of this stage is pretty much like your uh, go to uh, have good Yoshi movement, I guess. Like, Avoid nudging corners and uh, jump up and down slopes. I always found that part really annoying because of all the things that can eat you and take all your eggs. Yeah. Shoutouts to Jack879, holding it down. Right, so this level has a bunch of uh, flying condoms in it, no big deal. that foam really well. Yeah, it looks like you didn't slow down at all.
Okay, so right here, I'm gonna try to do a gate hack. Alright, got it. Nice. We've seen that trick a couple of times. Yeah. So you open the gate from uh, the other side, basically, and that completely breaks this level. And what I did right after was uh, a perfect flutter. So basically, um, there's a three-frame window when you uh, repress the B button to uh, do another flutter, when you chain flutters, um, where you can gain one pixel of height, I think? Or something along those lines, and it helps you reach ledges that uh, the game developers basically put barely out of reach, just like to tease you. Two five is a favorite amongst uh, runners of this game. Myself included. I really, really like this level. Oh, that was a perfect first screen. Perfect second screen. To not lose momentum in a room like that takes a long decision. Yeah. Okay, it still worked. So I despawned the cannon by creating a lot of sp sprites using that big fat egg. But like my movement was not as good as I thought it would be, so I thought that maybe I would not get the despawn. Fortunately I did. Okay. 
And right here, I'm gonna skip the car, because the car does not roll deep. There we go. That'd be some kind of speed boost. Speed boost? Well, you'd think the car would be. Yeah, but like, transforming into the car takes so fucking long. And I think you move slower when you're the car. Yeah, it's not even fast. Yeah. Oh, but you can get over the spiky guy. Oh, I'm gonna jump. Yeah, that's true. glitch entrance that sends me to uh, the pipe that was right above the one where I executed the glitch that saves me another uh, few seconds Ooh, skipping that mid gate in the first few minutes yeah there's a way to like skip that midway gate by uh, going over it but you have to like do I think a frame perfect jump off like the yellow platform and that boosts you like super high up Playing this game casually, you can really appreciate the way you handle the room with like the guys dropping torpedoes. Yeah. Really a pain to push that thing off and go. And casually, you would just like ground pound and stun them for a couple seconds so that you have time to push um, the pot further. But you can also shoot eggs at it. Which I didn't know when I played the game casually. Probably not. Yeah. Mm. Not too sure why I did that. It's okay. I saw it's a bit strange that those blue spikes kill you in one hit. Mm -hmm. the game's uh, pretty big on its insta kill. <laughs> yeah, even through iframes, like spikes will kill you. Really? Yeah. Like the blue spikes, the yellow spikes, and lava also kills you through iframes, I think. Warpless is pretty damn optimized, isn't it? Uh, yeah, I would say so. But it's also like really, really hard to optimize because, like, how can I put it? Like, there's so little to do in between like uh, points of tech and levels. Because, like, basic Yoshi movement, uh, you're gonna understand this. Like, it's it's a lot more uh, easier to execute than basic donkey movement, for example. So, like, there's a lot less potential to uh, have more optimal movement uh, versus right. like maybe a top player. Uh, besides tricks, for example. <laughs> Yeah, I guess uh, you don't actually have to hold Y in this game, which makes it unique for SNES Auto Scroller. Mm. I mean, you know, I'm just... <laughs> 
Well, I mean, yeah, yeah, you have to hold Y to go fast in my real world. You have to uh, run in Super Metroid. Yeah, definitely see uh, where we're going. I actually never knew that until I talked to speedrunners about this game. I probably so many hours running around with Y in this game for no reason. <laughs> Here we are in Monkey World. One of my favorites, but I think Speedrun Entertainment. Monkeys yeah. are so badass. A lot of, uh, as you can see, precise landing on platforms. Some of them are pretty small and you can't slow down at all, so you gotta make sure you jump. Yeah, like the platform section is actually a good example of like where having good movement like versus a top player for example really shines. And ideally you don't get hit in this level either, but this level is pretty hard. It's short but like there's a ton of stuff going on. Oh my god, Ooh, all in one, boys. I hate this submarine part. Yo, same. <laughs> Transforming into a vehicle, any vehicle in this game, does not roll deep at all. It's slow and painful. Hmm, interesting movement. I'm glad it worked out.
We're gonna talk about weird bosses in this game. We're definitely gonna see one here. Oh yeah. <laughs> what do you do with like his HP? Like kind of changes depending on where you hit the uvula or something. Mm -hmm. Since we know, what's like the least number of hits? You can... It's five, I think. I'm pretty sure. Uh, well, it's it's five RTA. But like maybe the task doesn't inform, I'm not quite sure. Weird. And the strat for um killing this boss in five shot was made consistent. Uh kinda recently actually. basically has to do with uh, the distance between the egg and the uvula uh, multiplied by like the speed of the egg or some shit like that. Mm. Shouts to uh, Raiden the Quick for finding that formula. It's interesting they even bothered to give it such a complicated... Yeah. They just like <laughs> count down from seven or something. Mm -hmm. It's like this boss can take as many shots as like 15 to kill. That was, I think that was pretty close to 5. But at least I didn't take damage, so we good. Arne has a 50 shot kill, damn. <laughs> what a god. Rolling deep rip. Change. RTA in Japan raid, holy moly. We should have busted out the uh, RPG host alerts. <laughs> We've got a roll in deep host. Yeah, that's hype. Yo, shouts to Zara for holding it down. So, yeah, welcome everyone. Really? <laughs> Bacteria on the screen, they're watching. What did you say, Canis? <laughs> Somebody said trillions of years, so I mentioned the bacteria on the screen you can see it, so I got Oh <laughs> Yeah. So welcome to me doing my uh, first uh, Yoshi's Island Warpless run in over two, three months, I think. It's going pretty well so far, I'm surprised. 
Yeah, I hope you guys stick around because later tonight we have uh, some uh, Castlevania role in the gameplay by uh, the one and only Canis999. Followed by the legends of Castlevania 4. Yeah. Joe and Furious Paul. Numbers 1 and 2. It's lit, dude. The stream is now lit. Because I'm swallowing a bunch of monkeys. That was a pretty decent 3-7. Oh man, people seem excited for uh, Castlevania 3, Canis. Fun game, man. Try not to die a whole bunch. Yeah. Sub 30 this run? <laughs> Practice. <laughs> <laughs> from 63 viewers to 1,600. Holy <laughs> <Big> crap! <laughs> Here's to me uh, not missing this quick kill, hopefully. <laughs> Yeah, I think this marathon ends Saturday night, Sunday morning, something. Yeah, we got some pretty crazy plans for that night. Are you, are you guys doing OT glitch list that night? I'm not sure if we're doing that or SMB3, but either way, I'm pretty sure it's not going to be a cyber event. <laughs> yeah. And we're ending, I think, with the lost levels. Race. Oh, sick. Fuck. So that Piranha is like the worst fucking enemy in the game. Couldn't click through it. Yeah, I sort of have like the opposite of iframes there. Like, after you hit him for a very brief period, he can't hurt you. So you want to try to go through them during the but it's really tight. And if you shoot the boss off screen, you don't have to fight it. It's actually a developer intended. That's a really cool skip and saves like three minutes. Because that boss is slow as fuck. Don't swear? Hello? This is the Rolling Deep Marathon. Raw, uncensored, uncut. Yeah. Yo, we've got the Rolling Deep uh, Yoshi runners in chat. Shoutouts to uh, Andy Kuma and uh, Pidge, even though Pidge doesn't run Yoshi, but uh, she won the uh, Super Mario RPG race last night, so that that's, that still qualifies as a um, good ship. So yeah, halfway through the world's in this game, but runs actually uh, got a ways to go till halfway over. Game really picks up in I think difficulty as well as the length of uh, levels. Yeah. So this one is particular in particular is like fucking bullshit because yeah, now I got fuzzied, so at any point I could clip through uh, those platforms. It's actually like really really scary. One of the dumb mechanics of this game. Fortunately that didn't happen, but I did lose uh, quite a few runs to that bullshit. 
Is it only you... when you are dizzy? Yeah. So I guess something about the way those guys like warp and contort, they didn't quite have the hitbox quite right during that. Yeah. Because like the platforms wiggle, sort of. And because of that, I guess you can clip through them easily if like you just hold forward. And yes, this game promotes drug use. You're goddamn right! Fine, we're fine, everything is fine. There's an easy one to die in. Yeah. Uh, speaking Ooh. of which. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. I'm not dead yet. I'm not dead yet. Whoa! Oh my god, I just saw- Oh my god! I don't know how I didn't die, but... Yeah. I guess that, that, pro that, that probably cost me as much time as death right there, but... It looks so cool though. What yeah, it, it, it looks better this way. <laughs> So 4-4 four, four is probably one of the longest levels in the game that's like pure execution. Oh yeah. You don't grab any uh, midways, do you? Uh... Oh, yeah. There's one, but like... I mean like during the four rooms, four corners. Yeah, we, you only have one midway, so like, I'm grabbing it right now, because uh, it's kind of likely that I die in this room. See? That was this... Really? The blue spike room? I'm surprised you say that. Lava seems hardest. 
Lava is actually not too bad. Unless, like, you can get your jump eaten. Ooh, I almost... <laughs> I almost ran into the spike. As we talked about me dying in this, uh, this room. What do yellow and red eggs do? If you break a yellow egg, uh, it gives you a coin. If you break a red egg, it gives you two stars. And red eggs are uh, like all over the place in Hondo because they're actually really, really useful to uh, skip midway rings. Hopefully Canis didn't jinx me here, and I'm gonna make it, make it out of this uh, room safely. Saying something's hard can't jinx it. Saying it's easy is what jinxes it. Yeah, well, I didn't say that this room was hard. <laughs> Alright, we did it. Fat eggs are the best. Agreed, man. That was not the strat, but that's okay. Uh, maybe like a minute and a half behind PB or something. Which is not the worst, I guess. So uh, this boss is like bullshit. <laughs> His hitbox doesn't make any fucking sense. And he takes forever to kill. Fast, so. Yeah. So we're gonna break this level as well. Just gonna jump on the scoopa and skip the fact that I have to uh, travel around with that huge uh, chomp rock. I can ground pound uh, this thing. I'm gonna do the same thing here again. Uh, hopefully. Alright. Well, I unfortunately uh, swallowed the melon bug, so I can do uh, the swag strat.
Flower is bad, man. You get bonus. Yeah. You need a lot more than one to uh, risk a bonus, though. Joysticks thing is cool. Oh, did Joe put my uh, input display on stream? Yeah. Oh, nice. That is fresh as fuck. Get hack here. And basically the rest of the level is me riding this uh, platform. And hopefully not dying here. Definitely done that before. I actually forgot the strat and forgot to uh, despawn that thing, but that's okay. Perfect. This is a skip as well, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. So like right there, I just... Um, Tonged through the wall to grab the uh, arrow cookie, and that just like completely skips the huge room that uh, you saw me enter. Usually supposed to uh, go the other way to collect the key. Like the breakout room. Oh, with the Tetris box? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like rooms with uh, those kinds of blocks. They're like. I don't know. <laughs> They're just like fun to break. 
Ah, I was supposed to press the button, not hold it. <laughs> Does the uh, extra damage hits work against this guy? What do you say? How do like the special hits work against this guy? Do you like do more damage or something? Uh, no. Oh, okay. He just dies in three hits. Hopefully I get Moon Jump, just because... That rolls deep. Nice. So it could take uh, pretty long for Mayoshi to come back down. <laughs> All right, it didn't. <laughs> to uh, your favorite world, right? Yeah, shoot me. <laughs> <laughs> Wolf 5's bitch. Wolf 5 has a lot of really long auto-scrollers, but the non-auto-scroller levels are really hard. It's just one auto-scroller. I think it's just one, but it's like a super long one. Yeah, 5-6 is like the worst. It's not the longest auto scroller in the game, but it's the most boring one for sure. At least 6-5 has good music. Yeah. Okay, music is definitely uh, one of my favorites in this game. Alright, not too bad. That last screen can... can go so much worse than what just happened right now. You can do a perfect flutter there to uh, reach that ledge without having to bounce on the penguin, but... I messed that up. It's not a big deal. Now you just ride the cloud, chillin'. Hi, in the clouds. Part was always kind of tricky because those snowmen on the ski lifts, uh, if you, you try to bounce on them like any other enemy, you'll just like fall to your death. Yeah. It's like a different bounce mechanic. You don't get your flutters when you bounce on the snowmen. Alright. Hardest level in the game coming up.
First train is uh, most likely the easiest. It's a good thing I got that down. This one is not too bad except for those uh, pillars right there. Alright, we're through. But this, this one is the absolute worst. Hopefully I don't get exposed. So... <laughs> I have good aim. Made sure to clear the path. To not get owned by those blue spikes. Those blue spikes I've claimed uh, many, 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 many runs. Grabbing the save ring because uh, this key section can be extremely trolly. It's just smart for a marathon track, especially that those blue spikes that can instantly yeah. seen that kill a lot of runs. And it's like the worst spot to die when you're playing at a high level because the next level, 5-4, contains the hardest trick in the game and just dying like when you're uh, past halfway in 5-3 is just the absolute worst. Like so close to having your shot at getting first try 5-4 and just falls flat. Man. Yeah, I think I'll give this a couple of shots just for uh, the swag, but there's like less than 1% chance that I get 5-4 skip. I haven't practiced this in months. If I make it to the bats, then I'm gonna be pretty happy. This trick makes pretty much everything we do in the donkey game seem like an easy trick. Not wrong. Forward, dude. Definitely got to the bats. Yeah. I'm gonna try it again. I'm pretty confident. 
So, like, the bats were slightly too low, so I kind of lost track of where the two bats were, the first two. And I just, uh, jumped to my death. to do uh, the two-stop, which I've never done before. Okay, never mind. <laughs> My finger just didn't want to repress the B button. I'm trying it again. These floaters are not easy to stick height on. Yeah. The so natural get... tendency is definitely lose significant height mm. on each. You have to repress within th three frames to uh, not lose height. Now I think I'm not gonna get it anymore. My arm already uh, feels tired. It's probably gonna be uh, my last try. Yeah, definitely my last try. Too bad. I almost got it, though. I'm, like, really you surprised. Got really yeah. Dad, you'd be happy if you got the bats, man. Mm -hmm. Keeps so close. Yeah. Usually, like, my best performances when I, uh... try to strike out are, like, the first few. Yeah, I feel like... Because, like, that's when your, like, harm is, like... Well rested, I guess. Yeah, and like you're most ready to like get into it. Like mm -hmm. if you get so close to the end, and you like sometimes psychology of having to start it. Yeah. Damn, now I got to do all that again and more. Yep. Now I'm gonna have to uh, ride this uh, dumb platform. If you get first try five four skip, it saves close to a minute and a half. But it's really really difficult to execute hardest trick in this game by far by far if you do it in 100% you have like a lot more shit to do <laughs> than just uh, fluttering and baiting the bats then you could do all that and like take damage afterwards and, like no stars yeah. <laughs> There's right before, I think. What did I give as an estimate? Like, 155? Yeah. Okay.
Okay, so this guy has a really cool quick kill, but it's kind of tricky to do. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make it so that the eggs spawn inside him. What? Crazy. Well, it didn't work as planned. I got one shot, but uh, yeah. Oh, I got two. And I got three. <laughs> I'm surprised I was able to salvage the last two because uh, I I was completely off position. level the uh the placement on it guys is just so cool So, fortunately, the next level is gonna be fucking boring. Another auto-scroller. One of the longest in the game. Part I think I hate most about it is you gotta constantly kill the, the Lakitus. Yeah. Watching What's up, Godfather? Where the fuck were you? Sleeping? Sleeping? Why are you sleeping on Void? Uh, he's playing uh, 
with his uh, eggs here. He's juggling them around. <laughs> He's cooking you an omelet. Yeah. <laughs> Rolling deep omelet. Uh, what, 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 what's going on here? Uh, 900 people are watching this. In the yeah, we, we got, they're thing. in Japan. We got raided by RT in Japan. Oh. oh okay. And you missed it, dude. That was 3,000 people then. Yeah, you could have provided the most rolling deep commentary, but instead you were sleeping. <laughs> well. So I see we're on a side scroller here, we're hiding the clouds there for it. Yeah, it's almost over. Fifty viewers when me and Kurt Q were uh, representing here. Mm -hmm. uh oh. Um. Ah. Power up. That was scary. <laughs> That's still the auto scroller, isn't it? What? You can go through that? Holy cow, dude. Yeah. Another crazy save, man. Yeah, and I had no eggs, so I was really fortunate that the bubble went down. I, I didn't even take the save ring, that screen, so if I died, I would have had to play the Yellow Scroller again, and RPG would have probably went back to sleep if that happened. No, it's not, uh, it's not a, a, a false uh, statement there. Is that English? It's the uh, RPG uh, talk. Oh, this is Yoshi's Island, uh, all, uh, all eggs down, uh, down your fucking throat percent, uh, I'm gonna shove them all down fucking Void's throat. <laughs> <laughs> and then maybe he'll, uh, change his mind about Evo, I don't know. I have no thoughts about Evo, please. What came first? The chicken or the egg? Now what's coming first is I'm bringing fucking Super Barman 2 to fucking AGDQ and you're fucking playing it. That's right. Me? No, Void. No, RPG said that if I play Super Bomberman 2, he would play Super Mario RPG. I, I didn't say if you played it. I said if you beat my PB, which is improved. You said sub-24. You didn't say beat my PB, you said sub-24. Well, I did say sub-24, but I don't know, now that I got it and... I mean... I mean, wouldn't you feel incomplete if you're on the leaderboards and you wouldn't even... What do you have now? Uh, 2319. Damn! What's world record? And then 21... like, 48. Damn! Good shit. <laughs> Good shit. I'm at the. Uh, gonna have to go crazy here in this chat here. I mean, are we, are we making fun of Bomberman now? Uh, what's going on? What's going on? Uh, does somebody need to get spanked? We need to break out a fucking belt here. What's going on? Super. 
Agreed, dude. Well, we do have Castlevania 3 and 4 coming up, which is actually pretty exciting. You're excited for those? Yeah, I woke up just in time to uh, skip the monkey business and catch the end of this uh, little fucking omelette fucking... <laughs> Why don't you PB in this game again, IPG? Uh, cause then I had to put it in my fucking console. Why wouldn't you? Uh, cause I've got, uh... Got Bomberman games to play here, I mean, come on. Their JPRC, that's rolling pretty deep. I mean, you had uh, that Geo Man were on those fucking awesome. I was I was watching that and uh, it was a really good run. Mm. Mm. Getting trolled by uh, the fucking bird again. Oh, is it an eagle? An eagle party? Falcon, it's a, it's a falcon party. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a falcon a, fiesta. It's a raven RPG. Know the fucking lore, please. It's a raven rave. Uh, I didn't know you had some uh, Disney fucking. Uh, That's a raven. Super team here. Why are you saying it's Disney? I don't understand. No, well, it's pretty fucking. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, those JP runners are pretty serious business. Uh, serious monkey business? No, no, they don't monkey around. Uh, sorry. Wow. Unbelievable. Well, that's factually not true. Uh, they were. They, one of them did uh, uh, make another one eat another, a banana while he fed him a banana, I guess. So uh, there was that. Alright, that was my boy Fees. Alright, well, let's snap the strap. It's okay, we, we, we recovered. So we're, we're doing the 5 4 skip? Is that. Uh, I tried. Oh, I missed it. Yeah. Well, you were sleeping. Yeah. <laughs> well, why, so why would you back be to bed then. Why would, why would you be sleeping during the best walk of the marathon? D during the 5 4 choke? I don't know. Yeah, we want to sleep during the early monkey early business, RPG. RPG. The monkey business. Like, you should have joined me. Yeah, no. I'd still be playing, like, DKC2 right now. That's right. Yes, CFB. I can tap my controller the same way. Listen.
My input display doesn't work during loading screens, CFV. But yeah, for everyone holding it down, this is the Rolling Deep Marathon, and it will be going on the next two days. Tomorrow we're going to have a Zelda block that's going to roll pretty deep. Um, then you're going to have uh, pretty much the dopest day of them all, which is going to include... Your phone go down. No, I... <laughs> Yeah, hello. Yeah. Will you come and take my donkey runs tomorrow afternoon, RPG? Or will you be sleeping like a bitch again? Commentators, can you give the audience at home a good summary of what Rolling Deep is all about? Well, let's see what Overfiend has to say about this. Right, so on the Ridley fight. <laughs> RPG will answer that after his phone call, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, PG. Yeah. What does Rollin' Deep mean? What does Rollin' Deep mean? Well, uh, it's when two or more people involved in Rollin' Deep activities <laughs> accurate Without using the word in its own definition <laughs> <laughs> you can't roll well, I guess you can roll deep by yourself but that's like really more of a modern term -ish thing because rolling deep means that you're in a group of people like if I'm rolling you know, we're rolling five deep right now with me over Fiend and Canis and Void, but, uh... Is that really all it means? Because I think most people know... know that. RPG? Yeah, yeah, go go on. Uh, complete your sentence. 
I mean, people know about like the rolling, like rolling 30 deep, Rappler type, uh, meaning. Yeah, that's, uh, usually what it means is you're, it's a group of, a collective of people. And they're rolling deep. Like, rolling plenty deep. You know? Rolling. Yo, what's up? Rolling 10 what's deep. Yeah, rolling 60. Dude. <laughs> Yo, your milkshake took forever to make. Well, I'm eating ice cream instead. So, apparently, uh, I was going to do this, I guess, Super Mario Brothers 3 or Okarun and Time. Uh, thing on Saturday, but now all of a sudden, I guess some girl's coming over and uh, probably not gonna be able to make it. Why? Uh, because I might be uh, sticking it in. I don't know. <laughs> Hello? What is what does sticking it in mean? <laughs> well, it's when you go. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Well, I just wanted to explain for the viewers. <laughs> well, I mean, it's 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 uh, <laughs> so it happens when you uh, you know you, you you give her what she wants, uh, fuck her right in the pussy, yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> so, um. <laughs> right, right, right. Um. <laughs> It definitely sounds like she wants it, so... Yo, thanks for the Reddit rack, CFB. But I should be able to complete my segments all the way through EVO, and then... I, I don't know. I, well, why are you talking about EVO when I'm playing Yoshi's Island? I, well, why the fuck not? It's uh, <laughs> the superior speed game, clearly. I mean, if you're gonna be a fucking dinosaur, uh, let's not be a fucking uh, <laughs> googly eyed fucking baby carrying fuck. I don't know. Do your dinosaurs throw eggs, though? They fucking transform into bigger, better fucking dinosaurs. Yeah, but they get owned by fucking yetis, so what's the fucking point? Uh, they don't- I, did, did you see my fucking low percent dino run? No, you fuck face. Come on. Why, why should I care? Why should I care about your- uh, Why should you care? Because it's you're the fucking, fucking, fucking low percent. It's, 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 the most, <laughs> it's the most epic speed run that's ever, uh, happened this year. I mean, come yeah, on. Yeah, 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 yeah. The most epic speedrun in 2016 is a local Yeah, you should ask game. Blunt Bunny about that. I'm sure you will agree. <laughs> Speaking of Blunt Bunny, where is he? He is online, but not socializing. Yeah. No. Nope. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, RPG, can you make the sound of the parrot in DKC3 when he takes a hit? <laughs> what um, kind of hit? <laughs> well, <laughs> well, that was... Do, 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 do. Seven out of ten? No, I'm trying. Yeah, that's <laughs> that was bad. <laughs> uh, are you choking on something there, uh, Zoma? <coughs> oh, that was better. <coughs> no. I, I find it ridiculous that uh, we didn't get the V-Base when Kurt Key was here, but okay. The deepest roller of them all. He crashed and burned right in front of him. <laughs> yeah. I give this run a two out of ten. <laughs> Thanks, Joe. <laughs> I give this run a fucking disgraceful. Uh... Oh, that's 
Uh, let's try that again. Don't worry, I think uh, Bomberman Fantasy is probably the best run that I've played. Really? Yeah, that's that's your that's your top pick for this marathon so far? I mean, I was in tears laughing twice. So. <laughs> that run did roll pretty deep. Yeah. That was that was the hot 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 pick of the marathon. <laughs> Our, RPG was committed at the end. He was like, I can fucking PV, and then he missed the skip. And apparently it was your fault, Arifin. <laughs> it always is. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I'm getting owned by uh, this uh, fucking level right here, so... Good thing I grabbed the save ring. <laughs> so falling there, uh... Uh, void, was that a RNG manipulation or something? Yeah, actually, it's gonna it guarantee that I'm gonna get uh, tongue and ass against Bowser. So you're gonna toss some salad here? What's going on? So first we're talking about pussies, and now we're talking about tongue and ass. Alright. Just circle. making sure that I'm following... Well, well, what, what do you have in your mouth, <laughs> Zelda? What, 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 what are you eating? Well, what? besides a bag of bricks. Right now, I have a right now I have a spoon in my mouth. It's really ah, hard. It's more spooning now. <laughs> <laughs> it's really hard to talk. It's really horrible. <laughs> what, what flavor ice cream? Uh, chocolate. Uh, of course. Just of chocolate. course. Is it always chocolate? Yeah. You, 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 basically, you, you, nothing you, but chocolate you, ice cream. You, 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 the the past chocolate chip. Six months. What's going on? No butterscotch? Hell no. Hell no. Raspberry swirl? No, uh, if you're liking what you're seeing here, you should uh, follow Joe D'Amelio, and then you should uh, follow the runners uh, exclusively over Fiend and, uh, and myself. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> what did you just say? It was something nice. Hey, it was. It was. I don't know what else to do. I mean, you said some 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 popping some junk about some Bomberman, man. I don't know. Oh, no. What is that tweet, CFB? <laughs> oh. So it gives me nightmares, I suppose. Prettiest. In SP run, I think this level is pretty boring. There's really not much going on. Oh, we're talking about the game again? Yeah! Ball! It's kind of cool that it's uh, a regular level, but they gave it the music of a dungeon. Yeah, I really like that as well. Well, at the moment, uh, we're having a rolling deep uh, a meeting here. 
rolling deep advisory meeting. Uh, which means we're we're pulling out our blunts and we're uh, <laughs> breaking out our bongs. And, uh, <laughs> Six deep. <laughs> rolling. Deep. We're getting high in the clouds here. I think I should do that before Castlevania. Well, I mean, you only need to be too deep to be to be rolling, but I mean, you can roll <laughs> sing solo deep. I mean, single-handedly, I roll deeper than like I don't know the whole uh, <laughs> the whole. Are you gonna say the whole crew? No, not the whole crew. I want to say like the whole uh, presidential uh, resident. Uh, <laughs> Panel or whatever. Oh, we're gonna talk about the election now. Everybody gets quiet. Ah, uh, Mr. Zero could have that. That would have that would have been dope to have uh, Mr. Zero do her own actually. Yeah, playing cat game. The cat game quadrilogy. Man, I'm on the last level. Already. It's about <laughs> fucking time. Alright, crank your uh, music up uh, at the boss fight here. Uh. <laughs> hey, you know what, RPG? Just, just, just turn your fucking audio up. <laughs> just turn it off. Do, do, do it yourself. <laughs> do it yourself. <laughs> this is the single best part of the game. Uh, uh, you're playing a Quidditch match here with the uh, Chemic, the witch. Or... <laughs> yeah, a Quidditch match, exactly. Trying to catch the golden stitch. <laughs> So, are you gonna learn guitar, uh, the guitar uh, way to play uh, this Selma? You gonna find some Yoshi? <laughs> the get? Did you say guitar? <laughs> yeah. Sorry, the guitar, uh, to... guitar solo intermission. <laughs> you gonna plug in there? Uh... <laughs> oh, you mean the? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. For Yoshi, the Yoshi theme with the boss things. <laughs> 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 Drop that bass. So uh, we got door number one there. Are we uh, scrubbing it up here? It's the second best door to get. Uh, that, it's not the best door to get now, is it? Uh, no. <laughs> like <laughs> you really door number four. Yeah, in a speedrun, you really need door number four because it's so much faster than any other doors. <laughs> yeah. Door 3 is the worst because it's an auto-scroller and you're followed by this big spiky ball with uh, clown noise. Uh, noise. Nose. Nose. Cl clown nose. Yeah. We're basically followed by uh, the boss of 6-4. Yeah. Tap tap. The ghost. The boss names in this game are awesome. Uh, the the pot boss is called Roger. Roger the pot. Bert the bashful. Salvo the slime. Crank it up, boys. <laughs> do, 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 do. Right, I'm putting on full blast here. Are you gonna do a? Are you gonna try to do a vocal solo RPG? No, I'm going to uh, bang my head and uh, <laughs> <laughs> 
Starting uh, like, like I'm at, in the yeah, like, like I'm at a fucking. That's a little too early, RPG. Time is after. There's like two text boxes after this, isn't there? Ah, uh, yeah. There, there's one on the Japanese version. Ah, okay. It's right after the text box. There you go. Bam. Bam. Okay, so let's see how much stream delay there is. Oh, it was like a minute. Man. Oh yeah. Okay, thirty seconds stream delay. Yeah, it's basically like two Twitch delays. Yeah. So it's like not bad for getting wrecked in six five and Attempting 5-4 skip a bunch of times and failing miserably. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Was that a casual cut the zone over there? Well, you see, um, if he cuts me, that means he cut you as well. What do you have to say about that, RPG? RPG. RPG? Yeah. The Godfather has been reduced to silence. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably too busy talking to his chick on the phone. Wait, what? The RP chick? Yeah. 
So GG Void on the run. Up next, we're gonna have Castlevania 3 Dracula's Curse done by Canis, followed by a race between Furious Paul and myself, Joe D'Amelio, in Super Castlevania 4. And then uh, you know, I'll top it off with a little bit of a Super Vows 4. And this is the Rolling Deep Marathon. Uh, this is raw, uncut, uncensored. Anything goes in this marathon. <laughs> Busting it out. Oh, is my mic on? Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> Yep, so whenever you guys want to switch or anything, take your time. I don't care. I'm just going to uh, edit all the text and all just so I'm ahead of the game. Yeah. Hey, your stream's up, so... Are oh, your stream's up? Mm -hmm. I don't see you live. Yeah. Well, credits are done rolling, so pretty much whenever. Rolling out. Roll. Nice run, man. Thanks. Yeah, that was a pretty okay run there. You were sleeping <laughs> through like 80% of it, so fuck off.